So you want to be a game developer. You probably saw some Flappy Bird game that's earning like millions and you want to jump in on the gold rush and so on and so forth. Well, I am here to tell you the truth about game development. First of all, I'm going to tell you that everything you are told about game development is a lie. So everything that you believed, everything that you saw online is a complete lie. What do I mean by this? So I, I need to explain it because a lot of people are going to be in the comments like, oh, you're good at demotivating people. First, hear me out. What I'm saying, I'm trying to motivate you to go into game development the right way. So game development is not only about creating a game, put, putting it online and expecting to earn a lot of money and sustaining yourself, your family and helping your mom and whatnot and so on and so forth. It doesn't go like that. Those days are over because the first, you know, the first few people who jump into the app stores right away when they started, they got all of the cream pie and well, you, you know, we are taking out what's left from them. So why am I saying this? Because I see a lot of people online talking about, oh, game development is easy. You can learn it very quickly. You can learn it very fast and very easy and so on and so forth which in a sense is true. Game development is not that hard when you put the effort, you dedicate yourself, you dedicate your time, and you will eventually learn it and master it. But it's not as simple as a lot of people say online, okay, be job ready in four weeks or you know six weeks. I hate to break it down to you, but it, there is no program, online course, whatever, that you teach you game development and you will be job ready in four weeks, no matter if it costs a, a gazillion dollars. It simply doesn't go like that. Game development is a path. It's a journey that you need to take and that you need to be consistent on. For example, I published a few video series titled Road to 1 Million with Game Development. And I published one game of them. So I'm going to create real world games, publish them online and earn money from those games. But the reality is, how can I get to those $1 million with one game? No, I've published already one game and it's not earning <laughs> not even close to $1 million, okay? I will talk about it in a separate video, but my point is you, as a game developer, as a youngster who want to jump in, it's not only enough for you to basically, you know, learn how to create games and, you know, jump right into it. You also need to be smart about how you will earn income from game development because, it's not that easy to earn a lot of money from your first game. So you will need to be smart about it, which means it's not only about game development. It's not only about creating games. It's also running a business. This is how you need to think about game development. That's why a lot of people, a lot of new developers and even old ones, they fail. They don't learn marketing. They don't build an audience. They don't think of their game development as a business because at the end of the day, it's a business. You are creating a product, selling it to other people, and you are earning money from that product. Be that a mobile game with in-app purchase and ads or a Steam game where somebody has to buy your game to play it. It's a business. So you need to think of it as a business. You need to make a business plan. You need to think of a marketing plan, how you're going to sell your game. How are people going to hear about you and your game? And how are they going to buy your game? And in the meantime, while you're doing all of that, while you're thinking about your business, while you are thinking about your marketing, while you are creating your game, how can you earn money to sustain yourself while you are developing the game? because that's the harsh reality a lot of game developers face. It's not as easy as, oh, enroll in my course and you'll be job ready in four months, in, in I don't know, four weeks actually. You'll be job ready in four weeks, five weeks, six weeks, seven weeks. You will get high paying jobs. It's not easy as that. Even if you want to jump in a company and work in a company, it's not as easy as, oh, just you know, enroll my course and learn and you're job ready. No, it doesn't go like that. So my advice is that besides from game development, you also learn how to run a business. You also learn about copywriting. You also learn how to build websites. You don't have to use HTML and so on and so forth. You can use, you know, drag and drop features, but you will have, you know, you will need a website. Learn how to use Google Pixel, Facebook Pixel to mark the people who come to your website so that later on you can market to them, learn how to market and all of the stuff in between. And in the meantime, think of something clever. For example, I thought about courses. So uh, in the meantime, while I'm creating my games, I'm also teaching people how to make games. And that's how I earn income to sustain myself besides from my other projects. So YouTube, 
my uh, my website, other websites I'm associated with, my games, which are starting to earn money right now. We're already working on a second game, and actually on a second and a third game, and have five games in queue to continue. And by the way, I have Pookie Ninja somewhere on here. I'll put it, you know, probably for you to, you know, download. Link is in the description below. But anyways, my point again is don't just dive into game development. Just create a game, publish it online, expect, you know, people are coming you know, with spreading spreading their hands towards you is not how it goes. So learn all of these features that come along with it. Learn how to run a business. Learn all of these good stuff. Anyways, uh, I, don't, I don't have anything else clever to say. Just, you know, follow here from monsters.com. Check out my website. Check out my games. Link is in the description below. Like the video and, you know, yeah, just do all the regular stuff. Help me support the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.